I can explain, J.D. I can explain. Yeah, stupid, 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 stupid liar! Eek! This isn't good. We have to run. To the exit, everyone. We're right behind you, Mr. Inaba. Well, uh, time to go. Bah! Big sister, please don't leave me. I'm sorry, KD. Instead of our bus waiting for us at the other end, there were police officers standing by. At last we were finally safe from that living hell. I think that there was never a landslide in the first place, and we were treated as missing persons. Then was that landslide we saw back then just an illusion projected by the ghosts of the mansion? Or were they guiding us to break the chain of death perpetuated by the sadistic brothers? Sadly, this mystery was beyond me. If I told the police everything that happened inside the mansion, but they'd have returned there in order to meet with the rest of the other passengers. However, not a single soul remained in that mansion. Not even the remains of Nagito Akashi was there to be discovered. All I could do was to bury Kaede's remains within a proper grave. And thus the curtain to this sordid case finally fell. This will be one mystery file I ne will never forget. Detective Sogo Inaba and his valiant assistant Nina Arimura are uh, fellow passengers. Oh, Mr. Nakagishi, before we found out that you were secretly psychotic. Death. Oh, that was uh, Akashi. Bus driver being poisoned at dinner. The argument. Mr. Mystery Novelist and Mr. Carpenter. Who actually, for all of his uh, being a big dumb, quote unquote, he actually uh, had a, a very uh, plausible deduction. Kaede! Oh. Doctor? I thought there was something up with you, Doctor. The way you just seem so utterly tired and uh, afraid constantly. There he is, Nagito. Here for Nagito to run. Cast concept. version done by the Memories of Fear team. Thank you for playing! Oh, hello. Here you go, Mr. Inaba. Your coffee is served. With both milk and sugar, correct? Yep, enough to give you a sugar buzz. Plus, I got you some of my Nina's Special Deluxe Homemade Cake just for today. Hmm. This coffee's not half bad. Seriously, if you hate bitterness so much, I can't understand why you bother drinking coffee at all. <laughs> oh, I get it now. You're trying to emulate those dark, handsome, hard-broiled, egg-type detect- Egg-type? Eh, care to repeat that? Ow, oh, he stopped pulling my cheek so hard! <laughs> oh, could that be our next client? Hello! Oh, Dr. Harima! Hey, Dr. Harima! It's good to see you! And you too, Nina. You look well. Are you making sure you're getting plenty of rest? Would you like a lollipop? Oh, <laughs> sheesh! Don't treat me like a child, Dr. Harima! Ah, sorry, sorry. I'm just having a bit of fun with you. Arimona, are you just going to let the doctor stand out there? Or would you invite him in for a chat? Ah, of course! Doctor, it's unusual for you to come here. Is there anything in particular that you need? <laughs> As a matter of fact, yes. 
I would like to request your services, our esteemed detective. Is this a new case for us? Hip hip hooray! Looks like I'm gonna get paid this month. <laughs> Are you claiming that you, you claiming that you didn't get paid last month? Hmm. <laughs> you know, I pay based on case and performance skills. <laughs> Naturally. If that's the case, then I'll earn a fortune this time as Detective Inaba's number one assistant. You were just waiting for an opportunity to say that, weren't you? Yeah, <laughs> read me like a book. Now then, let's hear about this case of yours while I gently take a sip of my morning cup of coffee. Oh, and on to the next case. I wonder, is Dr. Har- is this case with Dr. Harim a part of the sequel? We'll see in due time. But for now, I think we've got more endings we can get. I think here we... Yes, we saved right before. Grandmaster Key. I have to be... very... careful with how I am walking because I will absolutely well Mr. Inaba what's taking you so long hey big sister huh oh it's you Kate hey big sister you know Mr. Weirdo and his friend already escaped without you if they really but I'm fine with that. I'll stay here with you and we can play together forever. Uh, no, you have to be lying. Mr. Inaba, he'd, he'd never just leave me. He'll definitely come rescue me. No, he won't. Because Kaede here took those awful memories of this mansion from him. He won't remember all the bad stuff that happened here. You can't do that. That's a terrible thing to do. But I did it so I can stay here with my big sister. I'll never leave your side. Pinky swear, promise. Uh, ooh. Don't you want to be happy with me forever? I don't know what happened the other day, but somehow I found myself lying on a ground on, lying around on a mountain path. There were police crawling everywhere. They've been asking me so many strange questions for days now. Finally, I can get some must-needed rest and relaxation. I could go for a smoke. Mm -hmm. I have my pack. I have my lighter on me. Where's my pack of cigarettes? That's strange. I always carried them on me. Mm -hmm. Someone at the door. There's no one here. Oh, there's something at my feet. This is a pack of my usual brand of cigarettes and a flower. Who could have put these here? What was this flower called? A forget-me-not, I think. It's really beautiful. Maybe I should display it in my office. Oh, Kaede was talking about forget-me-nots. Oh. The symbol of... Oh. Oh, that's sad. Turning back now. Bye. This is intense music. Okay, we've obtained a rope. Alright. 
Alright, Umula, I've got a rope. I'm going to use it to pull you up first. Gotcha! The rope snapped. Uh, now what should we do? All we can do is find the key to open the storage room back up. Right on it. Please wait for us, Dr. Harima. We'll find that key and get you out as soon as possible. Well, wait just a moment! You're seriously gonna leave me behind? I thought you two were good people! Huh? Whatever gave you the impression that we weren't? We'd never... You two are colleagues, aren't you? So what am I to you both? A nobody. A stranger. I wasn't bored yesterday, you know. You'd feel nothing about leaving me here to die! Not a single thing! I can just hear you two laughing right now about the thought of my demise. Doctor, remain calm. We will come to rescue you. And then I demand that you rescue me right now! Get me out! Right! This instant! We cannot do the impossible, but please, wait and believe in us. You will rescue me right this second, so help me God. Wh what? Is that a gun? Doctor, did you also retrieve that from the, from the armory? Ooh! In a situation like this, we all have to watch out for ourselves. If you don't rescue me, I'll pull this trigger. I'll do it. Either I get to come with you, or one of you dies here. Doctor, don't. Watch out, Mr. Edip! What? Arimura! I... I didn't mean... You idiot! Arimura, hang in there, Arimura. Mr... Mr. Idaba, sir. You have to hurry... and escape. That doesn't matter to me right now. I'm not leaving you behind. Wake up, Arimura. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez, he's... Oh. oh, my God. What have I done? Why did you kill my big sister? Eee! <laughs> it was an accident. I really wasn't going to shoot anybody. Shut up. She was my big sister, and you... And you... <laughs> Get back! Stay away from me! Why did you kill her? Ah! Well, shit. I thought I heard an ex exciting future chapter for my book, but man, I can't believe this twist. Arimura's seriously dead? Oh man, that sucks. You. Isn't she lucky? Jeez, seriously saves me all the effort of killing her. Imagine the reader shocked to learn that this poor heroine died from the hands of the people she trusts. <laughs> it writes itself! Ah, uh, are you suffering inside, Mr. Inaba? Can't you feel that gut-wrenching churn in your stomach? Don't worry, my friend. You won't have to feel that way for long. I'm sending you off to meet her. Now she won't have to be lonely in hell! <laughs> Don't you dare speak ill of her. What's this? Am I feeling the raw essence of pure, unfiltered resentment coming from you? Yeah, But I'm being so nice to you. You don't want to live without your sweet Aunt Imbruna, do you? You don't want her to be all alone, right? Come on, I'm offering you a one-way ticket to meet her, courtesy of this blade. <sighs> Zogo's fucking pissed. Huh? What? I warned you. Now you'll never disrespect the dead ever again. Hot diggity! Uh, tame Grandmaster Key. Arimura. Ah! Oh, ah! Oh. Let's get out of here. Ah! Oh. Doctor. in now. Instead of our bus waiting for us at the other end, there were police officers standing by. At last I was finally safe from that living hell. I knew that there was never a landslide in the first place, and we were treated as missing persons. And was that landslide we saw back then just an illusion projected by the ghosts of the mansion? 
Or are they guiding us to break the chain of death perpetuated by the sadistic brothers? Sadly, this mystery is what's beyond me. I told the police everything that happened inside the mansion. Well, almost everything. I kept one thing to myself. I'll come back to this mansion one again someday to meet with the other passengers of that bus. So the curtain falls on that, this particular mystery file. It will be one that I can never forget. Especially considering the crime I had committed. A crime that will follow me throughout my life. Unpardonable crime. Okay. So what would happen in that instance? If we... Well, we would die. <laughs> that was bad. Try this again in the not dying path and the not picking up the knife path. Oh, nearly died. Okay. Uh, well, I'm dead. <laughs> now I'm not going to be able to do this. that. Go around this way. Okay, no knife. Can we go out through here? What happens if we go up? Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, here it goes. Blah! Eek! Okay, we fell. Wardrobe is locked. Okay, now we can save. This is no knife. Okay, if we pull Alimura up first. I get I suppose the logic here is that Alimura trusts us more to come back for her. Okay. You seriously can leave me behind? Uh, it, yeah, exactly. Who is he to us? We'll come rescue you. Right this instant. Oh my god. Is that a gun? How the fuck are we supposed to do that? Either I get to come with you or one of you dies here. Doctor, don't. Watch out, Mr. Yenipa! Huh. Arimura! Uh, I didn't mean... Arimura! Hang in there, Arimura! Mr. Mr. Inaba, sir. You have to hurry and escape. Oh, that's that sad face, though. Oh, jeez. That doesn't matter to me right now. I'm not leaving you behind. Wake up, Arimura! What have I done? Why did you kill my big sister? <laughs> it was an accident. I really wasn't going to shoot anybody. Shut up. She was my big sister. And you. And you. <laughs> Get back. Stay away from me. Why did you kill her? <laughs> Doctor. I thought I heard an exciting and future twist chapter from my book. But man, I can't believe this twist. Audi Murr is secretly dead? Oh man, that sucks. You. 
Isn't she lucky? Jeez, seriously saves me all the effort of killing her. Imagine the reader's shock when they learn that this poor heroine died from the hands of the people she trusts. Yeah! It writes itself! Uh, huh? Are you suffering inside, Mr. Hinaba? Can't you feel that gut-wrenching churn in your stomach? Don't worry, my friend. You won't have to feel that way for long. I'm sending you off to meet her. Now she won't have to be lonely in hell! <laughs> you think I'll let you kill me here after Arimura's sacrifice? Oh, are you gonna run away again? She's talking about boring and unoriginal. Ah, well, I'll just keep chasing you then, Mr. Inaba. <sighs> oh, shit! Arimura. Well, I'm dead. Let's get out of here. Oh, okay. Okay, I'm not dead. I'm taking you with me. Okay. Holy shit. There's nowhere left to run, you know. Oh, wait. That reminds me. Not like it'll matter in the end. You don't even have the key to the front doors. The lights. Damn, now what? Ah, well. This change is nothing. Just some mood lighting for the grand finale. You still can't escape from this. Huh? What was that? Uh, who's saying that? Show yourself. These are the voices of the people who died there. Get the fuck away from me. Die, die. We found you. I'll enjoy killing you. Die. I, I can't breathe. Help me. Help. Die with us. What the hell did I just witness? Damn, it's too dark to see anything. Good thing I have a light on me. What's all this? Are these the ghosts of the people who died here? We should be careful not to touch them. Now I can get out of here. Whoops. Need to get out of here as soon as possible. Sorry, Kaede. Looks like our only choice here is to just leave. Instead of our bus waiting for me at the other end, there were police officers standing by. At last I was finally safe from that living hell. I learned that there was never a landslide in the first place, and we were treated as missing persons. And was that landslide we saw back then just an illusion projected by the ghosts of the mansion? Or were they guiding us to break the chain of death perpetuated by the sadistic brothers? Sadly, this mystery was beyond me. After I told the police everything that happened inside that mansion, They'd have returned there in order to meet with the other passengers of that bus. However, not a single soul remained in that mansion. Not even the remains of Nagito Akashi were this there to be discovered. Thus the curtain fell on this case. This will be one mystery final I will never, for never forget. The last man standing. I mean, that pretty much covers all the endings to this game. Obviously, number one was the true ending. True ending, I suppose. The only one that gets credits. The only one where the case is solved and... The remaining survivors are able to escape. But I wonder if that's it. There's one last thing we're going to attempt to do here. Arimura. Huh? You should take your sweet time, Mr. Inaba. Please, I was going as fast as I could. Uh, let's not argue about semantics here. We've saved you, Miss Arimura. Now let's get out of here, post-haste. Big sister, are you leaving me? Is that you, Kaede? Why? Tell me why. Something feels off about her demeanor. I have a really bad feeling about this. You promised me you'd stay with me. You yeah, stupid, 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 stupid liar! Eh. This isn't good. We we have to run. 
to the exit, everyone. Right behind you, Mr. Inaba. Okay, we can't save. That's bad. We, however, can go upstairs. We are dead. <laughs> that sucked. <laughs> okay. Okay, now at least we know where we need where we can go. up and let's just go oh shit <laughs> let's go east then <laughs> it's still utterly jarring how just immediate that is I don't know if maybe this was obviously not an outright RPG maker horror game per se where they revel in the uh, death noises, but just boom, you are dead. Okay. Back to business. You have something important to do here. Oh, shit. What have I got to... I guess I have to go in the... I guess I have to go in the door. God, this is... Hardest mission in the game. Okay. In the door. Any ghosties down here? Yes. Alright. Just kind of pacing along. Uh, oh shit. Oh, uh, 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 uh. Okay. Uh, Mr. Inaba, why would you lead us to a dead end? I have an idea. Hear me out. An idea? This better work. It will. Now I'm going to blow out my lighter. Oh. Big sister, where are you? Oh! Mom? Me? Kaede. Kaede! My beautiful Kaede! That's you, isn't it? Mommy, is that really you? Yes, it's Mommy. Oh, I'm so sorry, my precious Kaede. You must have been crying for me all alone for such a long time. I was waiting for you, Mommy. I was waiting for you to come get me, but you never showed up. Yes, I know you were. Oh, Kaede, I hope you can forgive Mommy. You were suffering all on your own. Mommy! <laughs> Ah! Please don't leave me again, Mommy. Don't worry, my dear. Mommy will stay with you for as long as you want. You nor I have to be alone any longer. You. You're the ones who brought my precious daughter to me, aren't you? We did. I didn't feel it was right to leave Kaini alone any longer. It's all thanks for your efforts. We were finally freed from the confines of this godforsaken mansion. All three of you have my sincerest gratitude. Even you, Dr. Harima. You didn't really do all that much. Big sister. Mr. Weirdo. Thank you so much. Oh. Did they finally cross over to heaven? Yeah, I'm sure of it. Mr. Inaba, you were trying to save Kai and his soul, weren't you? I couldn't live with myself if I just let her be. Hey, I think it's about time we left leave this place for good. Instead of our bus waiting for us at, at the other end, there were police officers standing by. At last we were finally safe from that living hell. I learned that there was never a landslide in the first place, and we were treated as missing persons. Then there was that landslide back, and was that landslide back then we saw just an illusion projected by the ghosts of the mansion. Were they guiding us to break the chain of death perpetuated by the sadistic brothers? Sadly, this mystery was beyond me. After I told the police everything that happened inside that mansion, I later returned there in order to meet with the rest of the other passengers. 
However, not a single soul remained in that mansion, and even the remains of Nagito Akashi was there to be discovered. All I could do was to bury Kaede's remains within a proper grave. Thus the curtain to this sordid case finally fell. This will be one mystery file I will never forget. Da! Ah. And there it is, the true ending. Instead of having to run from Kaede to get out, we led her back to her mother, who was here all along. Now one last trip down these jazzy credits. You can see the see the resemblances in their characters' designs. Mr. Bus Driver and uh, Toa Nakagishi. They're both tall and lanky. That's my point. Oh, poor bus driver. You were pretty fucked up in the end. That was... Yeah, sure, those letters started out as, uh... Ah, Kaede! Playing the... Playing the hand-clapping game. Glad she found some peace in the end. Fucking letters started out as just a... Relatively normal, uh... Hey, I really love my bro, I'd do anything for him. To, uh... And just kind of, uh... Spiraled out of control from there. So to speak. But that came together! That was... It was very much... It was more supernatural than I expected from a straight-up murder mystery game, but it, it was it worked. It was fun. In the end, there was it was still a murder mystery game. In the end, there was no uh, supernatural crime solutions and the like. It's just a murder mystery with some supernatural ghosties. <laughs> and hand waving all of the. Puzzles as uh, supernatural ghost happenings too, which personally I found amusing. Here you go, Mr. Inaba. Your coffee is served with both milk and sugar, correct? Yep. And I have to give you a sugar buzz. Plus, I got you some of my Nina Special Deluxe homemade cake just for today. You got him some, or you brought him some? Hmm. This coffee's not half bad. Seriously, it's my favorite expression, right? That's right there, that's... <laughs> it's beautiful. Seriously, if you hate bitterness so much, I couldn't, uh, can't understand why you bother drinking coffee at all. Oh, I get it now. You're trying to emulate those dark, handsome, hard-broiled egg-type detectives. I have never had a broiled egg. I can't imagine it would be a good idea. Care to repeat that? Ow, oh, will you stop pulling my cheek so hard? Also, that's a... That is a peak Nina expression there. Oh, could that be our next client? Hello! Hey, Dr. Harima! Good to see you! And you too, Nina. You look well. Are you making sure you get plenty of rest? Would you like a lollipop? Sheesh, don't treat me like a child, Dr. Harima! Ah, sorry, sorry. I'm just having a bit of fun with you. Arimura, are you going to let the doctor stand there? Are you going to invite him in for a chat? Ah, of course! Doctor, it's unusual for you to come here. Is there anything in particular that you need? <laughs> As a matter of fact, yes. I'd like to request your services, our esteemed detective. Is this a new case for us? Hey, but hooray! Looks like I'm gonna get paid this month. Are you claiming that you didn't get paid last month? Y you know, I pay based on case performance. It's case and performance skills. <laughs> Naturally. If that's the case, then I'll earn a fortune this time, Mr. Doctor. Detective Inaba's number one assistant. You were just waiting for an opportunity to say that, weren't you? <laughs> Read me like a book. Now then, let's hear about this case of yours while I gently take a sip of my morning cup of coffee. On to the next case. But we get the true secret. Saving Kaede's soul. 
on to the next case. Will we see this? We'll definitely see Detective Inpa again. And his loyal assistant, Nina Arimura. Will we see Seiya, Seiya Harima as well? I assume so, based on this uh, post credit scene. That was fun. This is a charming little RPG puzzle horror. I say horror, some supernatural horror business. But not nothing too <laughs> nothing too significant. Nothing too well. I say it wasn't that huge, of, that huge a part of the plot, but literally the plot of the best ending involved all the ghosts getting revenge on the murderer who killed all of them there. But. It was interesting. Again, I question the idea of uh, the whole anagram name between the uh, character and culprit. Also, it, I mean, you could question the real realism of that, but it made for an interesting clue. Although, really, at that point, you could pretty much piece that together for how readily uh, Nakagishi brings out the knife in the two bad endings at the uh, case reveal. How quickly he breaks out the knife, and how thoroughly he turns the tables on you with that fact, fact about... Uh, Detective, Detective Inaba being the only other person who knew that dinner was being made, and the only one of them who was unaccounted for in that period of time. That was a clever bit of writing that's really easy to overlook until it's blatantly called out in the text. But that was that was well done in terms of a plot point to bring up to reuse in bad endings like that. That was good. The overall hmm. say what you will say what you will about the whole uh, about how well the whole uh, murder mystery uh, dang and Ronpa season whatever house was pulled off it was it was very much an interesting concept enjoyable. I hope you enjoyed. We'll see this crew again for the Mystery Files of Detective Inaba number two.